54 days until I moved to Grand Cayman for vet school to attend St. Matthews University and I'm very excited and when I was applying to vet school which was back in October-ish if I remember right um, I wish I had known someone who got into vet school and could have seen their essay honestly because when I sat down to write my essay I was just stumped and I found myself procrastinating because when I googled it nothing really came up and I just wanted to know what people were writing about to get in that is why I wanted to um, put this video up and have this section of my blog just be dedicated to vet student things um, to help anyone else out there that's like me well I got my BA in biology and my grades were not considered competitive to apply to vet school. So if you don't know what competitive grades GPA is yet, it's around 3.4. Um, so I heavily relied on my GRE scores and my essays, my main essay, my explanation essay, and my supplemental essay to get me to that next round of interviews. I did apply to some state schools, but since I declared that as my um, major, <clears throat> island schools were always kind of in the forefront of my mind of where I wanted to go for a couple of reasons, but that's another, it's a whole other video. So let me just emphasize, if you don't have a competitive GPA, you can try and get the, those high GRE scores. I truly believe my essay and my GRE scores got me to that next level of an interview with St. Matthews University. I'm considering posting my own essay to this blog. I remember googling vet student essay or something and a another girl's blog came up and she was charging 20 or 30 dollars to look at it. I don't want to pay for that. I want to see it but I'm not it's not like I'm using it. I'm just getting some idea of what direction or how what is an essay like this supposed to look like. So I'm thinking about just, you know, throwing it up there and hoping it helps someone, even just one person. <laughs>